Constellation was founded by five people. By Ben Jorgensen, Benjamin Diggles, Matthias Goldman, Wyatt Meldman Flock and Altif Brown. Let's now go through all five of them, starting with CEO Ben Jorgensen. Ben is a serial entrepreneur and has helped to establish various companies throughout his career, including very interesting spiritual meditation oriented platform Osho.tv. To this day, spirituality seems to be his forte. I don't know. Believe in yourself, man. I've doubled down, tripled down on, on myself. And like that, that tends to be my, my game. And I'm like, I know, I know what I know. And not everybody's going to believe in you and they're going to try to make you make sure you don't believe in yourself. He is not only a motivational leader, but also strategic decision maker. And so the next big step is really how do we make mass adoption with cryptocurrency? And we believe that by making tools and frameworks that are built towards real world businesses, people don't really know they're using cryptocurrencies, but businesses are able to push out to thousands of customers and users in a very, very seamless way or even visionary, so to speak, talking about AI-controlled consensus all the way in 2018. Why don't we use reputation and data observations uh, to decide how to organize clusters of data uh, and then use machine learning and algorithms to best select the right node cluster to validate certain uh, transactions. I believe involvement of AI in crypto is the next big thing. Benjamin Diggles is CSO in Constellation and has a rich background of business development and marketing. You're on a roll, man. It's amazing. Um, call me butter, because I'm on a roll. Uh, he is one of the most articulate speakers in the blockchain industry. Like in this instance. How much capital do you have left from the ICO, from the 33 million? He got a question that he wasn't willing to answer, so he talked for five minutes. And that uh, has been a has been a road. Uh, you know, I'm very proud to say it's funny because I get on calls with people. I'm like, hey, one of our first things we're proud of is that we've been in business for three years and we're still in business, unlike 95% of other blockchain programs. Yet not answering the question, but satisfying the inquirer nonetheless. Okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but uh, but happy I was able to answer a couple of your questions. Thank you. And yeah, it was amazing. It Thank tables. you. Yeah, exactly. Wyatt Meldman Flock is CTO in Constellation and has a four years of engineering experience. What Ethereum does is that it created something called a VM, um, which can you know perform actions within some kind of a sandbox environment. He might come across as slightly disrespectful. Now, the Ethereum people have absolutely no fucking idea how to build a distributed system. Or even arrogant. They didn't have degrees, they didn't have a fucking, any idea how even like the most basic fucking scalable architecture works. Although, so what, did, what he like, says you know, actually uh, makes uh, sense to me. Fucking, if we wanted to just create like an app, right? Like just a, like a Twitter clone. And maybe a Twitter clone where you can vote or share evidence about facts about shit, right? We literally would only need the linked list data structure. As I think that the crypto in the form that we know today is not going to survive the upcoming five to 10 years. The concept of a smart contract isn't going to exist in 10 years uh, because of this. If you're still building dApps, just like get a new job or start looking at DAGs. <laughs> <laughs> Matthias Goldman is CCO and has 12 plus years of experience being coach and psychotherapist coaching German Fortune 500 company managers. Wowzer, I think that's very interesting. And I also think that's where many of his financial ties come from as he seems to be the guy who got majority of DAX funding back in 2017. On my birthday, like our inbox got flooded and it was like, we want to give you 500,000, a million, a million, a million, five million, 10 million. I'm like, oh, dude. <laughs> I was like, who the hell are these people? <laughs> this has got to be fake. I've never heard of this shit. Um, and we just started jumping on the call. Matias started jumping on the call. He flew out to a, pl to play, a place to meet people. Altif Brown is a head of community in Constellation and he has an experience as community manager. He worked on a number of places prior to Constellation. However, he never worked anywhere more than 14 months which I find a red flag, actually. 
However, he is in DAC since the beginning, which is five years and counting. Behind the scenes, I'm not gonna lie to you, like, we fight. We fight like brothers. It's fascinating to see the variety of team dynamics between these five people. Now, there's times we don't always see the eye to eye, but there seems to be both tension. Let's not talk about how we had founder disputes in the past and relief. We also have had many founder resolutions. It reminds me a little bit of Ethereum back in the old days. It seemed like the team members had been close to falling out of the project or even the project bankrupting itself. Yet, as it turns out, they've come a long way since then. There's something a little bit different about us. There's some at least genuine sense of authenticity um, to us and our real beings. Hello, I'm the Centralized Dave. Don't forget to have a look at my Luxo review that I loved making very much.